Today let us study solving of a pair of linear equations in two variables. What is meant by solution of a linear equation? Solution of a linear equation is, a, is the values of x and y which satisfy the equation. There are two methods for solving linear equations in two variables. One is called graphical method, second is algebraic method. How to solve a pair of linear equations in two variables graphically? First of all, you know that a linear equation in two variables graphically represent a straight line. Here we have a pair of linear equations in two variables. So therefore, graphically they represent a pair of straight lines. A pair of straight lines in a plane can be intersecting, maybe parallel or coincident. When the two lines are intersecting, we say there is a common solution. Because we know every point on the line is a solution and every point on the second line is also a solution and there is a common point the coordinates of this point will be satisfying both the equations so therefore we say the coordinates of this point of intersection gives the solution of the pair of linear equations in two variables let us solve a pair of linear equations graphically with this example consider the two equations x plus 3y is equal to 6 and 2x minus 3y is equal to 12. For solving it graphically, first draw the graph of the first equation. For that, we have expressed the first equation in terms of y. It also can be expressed in terms of x also. Now, select the value for y, putting y is equal to 0, x is equal to 6 minus 3 into 0, that is 6 minus 0 is equal to 6. Taking y is equal to 1, x is equal to 6 minus 3 into 1 is equal to 6 minus 3 is equal to 3, and y is equal to 2, x is equal to 6 minus 3 into 2 is equal to 6 minus 6 is equal to 0. Let us write these values in a box. Here you can see that we have written all taken positive values because x is equal to 6 minus 3y. When the difference comes to be smaller number, it will be convenient to represent on a graph sheet. Similarly, we have done the solutions for the second equation as we have done expressing x in terms of y, then putting the value of y. Here you can see mostly we have taken the value of y as negative because the value expression containing 12 plus 3y. So if you take a plus value, the numerator will increase and as a result the value of x may have a bigger value. But it is convenient to take smaller values and that is why I have taken minus. And so we got the solutions which are written in the box. the points first 6 comma 0 x value 6 and y value 0 when y coordinate is 0 the point lies on x axis this is the point so only just to make a dot no need of making cross and this is for highlighting in order to show you don't draw cross and dot like this only just to make a dot next 3 comma 1 3 x is equal to 3 y is equal to 1. In order to make it visible, I am making it this way. Otherwise, only you have to make a dot in the actual graph. Third point is 0, 0. 0, 2. x is equal to 0 means y axis. On the y axis, we have this point. Next step, join all these points with the help of a scale. Let us now join the points. For joining the points, we have to keep the scale in such a way that the edge of the scale is touching all the three points and draw a line 
the end draw the arrow heads let us now plot the points for the second equation 6 comma 0 that is already marked one point 6 comma 0 next 3 comma minus 2 3 comma minus 2 comes here for highlighting it now see third point 0 comma minus 4 0 comma minus 4 all the three points are plotted now join all the three points with the help of a scale we have joined the points and both the points are uh, now intersecting both the lines sorry both the lines are intersecting at the point the coordinates of this point that is the x coordinate and y coordinate gives the solution by observing you can find out that x coordinate is 0 sorry 6 and as the point is lying on x axis its y coordinate is 0 so that is a solution of the pair of linear equations in two variables first find at least two solutions of each equation and write the solutions in separate boxes secondly plot the points and draw the line for the first equation next draw the line for the second equation and lastly find the coordinate of the point of intersection of the two lines which is the required solution now let us note down the assignment first equation x plus y is equal to 3 3 x minus 2 y is equal to 4 second set of equations 2 x minus y minus 4 equal to 0 x plus y plus 1 is equal to 0 Thank you.